Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome back to another MM Aviation video. Today I'll be attempting to land commercial aircraft at Padbury Airport, as many people have said it is impossible to land a commercial aircraft at Padbury Airport. I'm currently in X-Plane 10 using the Global Mobile. So let's go into free flight, and I have recorded this video three times before, but twice I've had the 747 glitch, and it wouldn't allow me to land, and it just kept on going straight into the sky. And I found out that many people have that issue, so I'll not be using it. And the last time the recording did not work, so... Yes, I've said it Pembury Airport that many times that now it's turned into Padbury for some reason. So we'll be in the Bombardier CRJ200 of the Lufthansa livery. Now I got confused on how to do this, but I've done this about 10 times in the past 10 minutes. So we know how to do that. Weather's all good. Time is sunrise. Everything is working and our weight is average. So even though you put your three nautical miles out on final and it tells you final approach, it doesn't put your gear down or anything like that. Did you know an instrument landing system ILS is a nav navigational aid that combines lateral guidance via localizer and vertical guidance via a, a glide slope? Yes, I did know that there was an ILS. Okay, so it always takes ages to load, so on the next few, well, it takes longer as you go, I will be taking it out of the video. Okay, we should be in shortly. Oh, we show us the loading before we get in. Okay, and then we will work our way up with aircraft. We'll probably go to the A320 and then to the 777. Perfect. Now it's calibrate with this dodgy calibration. Oh, on, why is this so bad? Okay, get down. Flaps to full. I'm just gonna check if it's screen recording, so it will cut off. Okay, finally it was for screen recording. Okay. okay. How are the graphics are gonna say aircraft? Not too nice from a close, but from afar it looks pretty good. New York approach. Um, I'm pretty sure when Pembury. Okay, we'll fly a heading of 150 for 31 right. We have no member. Okay, here we go. Some flaps. Oh, speed up a little bit. 400. And also, even if I fail or succeed in this, I will be doing this challenge in uh, probably Infinite Flight and RFS. Okay, here we go. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. There's a very big runoff on this runway. Okay, so that was just mainly because of the brakes. So I'll probably change the uh, the time of day to increase so that we're going to be able to see. So here is the airport, um, Pembury Airport. I believe it's in the UK and the code starts with EG, so yup. Uh, yeah, can't fix that. See, the airport is very small and surrounded with water. Well, not surrounded, but has water near it. So there we go. So now we will quit that. So we have achieved one landing so far. Now I'll change the time of day to about, let's go 6.30. Let's go 7.30, why not? Now we'll be going in the Airbus A320, which airline will fly there. US Airways don't exist, Air Berlin don't exist, Air Canada are in Canada. Hmm, let's go Air Berlin. And we have our weight to normal in these landings. It's not light weight, it's just regular weight. I'm not sure if it's regular landing weight or it's regular flight weight. So. Okay, I'm now back. I will have to use this dodgy calibration, so I'll put my screen to 90 degrees, then put it down to 45. Perfect. Get down. Thrust back. Speed brakes on. Speed rake and flaps down. Okay, 
Oh, I have no clue what's happening. No, I don't want auto trim. I hate auto trim. Wait, there must be some way I can turn it off. Uh, okay, so settings. Nope. Nope. Show graphics are full. Oh, just this nav data. Mm, okay, it looks fine. Okay. Thank you very much. What? Why can I not control? No, I don't want auto trim. Auto trim is so annoying. Could just leave me alone to fly the aircraft. Probably going to turn into MCAS soon. MCAS on the A320 Neo. Okay, what's the break for landing? Sink rate, sink rate, okay, sink damn. Why is this? No, I don't want to trim. That was a close save. Okay, this is. No, no. Damn. No, I don't want auto trim. Why? No. Sink rate. This is auto trim. This is work of auto trim. No. Oh. This is so annoying. Okay. Sink rate. Okay, we're going to change to 737. This X plane. Tear X plane uh, 10 Glomo has been. Yeah, it's not the best. Doesn't have multiplayer, is quite pricey well compared to other sims. And yes, the 747 is glitchy. They don't have many aircraft, they don't have many liveries, the airport. I don't really like the graphics that much. It's hard to navigate, it's hard to use, it takes ages to load. And yeah, they need to improve or reduce the subscription price. It's currently, for all aircraft, it is $9.50 in Australian dollars. So that is relatively expensive when X uh, RFS is about five dollars and Infinite Flight's about fifteen. So okay, let's fly the Sem Three Seven. Yes, look at that. No auto trim. Finally, I can fly the aircraft myself. Oh, MCAS is a different story on the Max. Let's take a look how this aircraft looks. Yeah, this is probably the best looking aircraft. Well, I just mean like the aircraft detail. Most of the other ones don't have so much detail. Yeah, Looks nice. Yeah, and yeah, there's no auto throttle, there's no auto trim. It's just the pilot flying the aircraft. Which well, should be. Sink rate, sink rate. Yes, I know there's a sink rate. Sink rate. Sink rate. Master caution. Four hundred. Need to slow down a little bit more. Three hundred. Two hundred. This is about one hundred feet above. Uh, above. Oh, what is it again? Above sea level. Okay, need to slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Up. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. 13, 20, 20 10. Brakes. So annoying how I can't turn the brakes on earlier. You do realise that I only have two hands. Explain. Yay, no auto trim. No nothing. Just me flying the aircraft. And we have touched down now. And we have made it. Look at that. Okay, and now for the last aircraft. The uh, 777-200ER, and we'll go British Airways, and, oh, X-Plane 10, Windows, I could get that on my laptop, there's no way my 8 year PC would be able to run that, but I could try on my Microsoft Surface Pro, that may work. Okay, stay tuned for that. And by uh, by the way, if you've any, if you know any way to screen record a laptop, please let me know in the comments below. That would be well appreciated. Okay, loading wasn't that bad. Yeah, now we are in the good old triple seven, one of my favourite aircraft. Well, it's like in my top three. Well, is my favourite. Well, I kind of like the A three fifty and the triple seven. And then, hmm, what else? Yeah, I would say they're my top two. 787 is also quite good, but A350 is just basically better. In my opinion, it is. And 747 is also not too bad. I've never flown one. 
A320. I kind of like it, even though it's small and on like a five hour flight, it's all crammed and small. I kind of just still like it, I don't know why. A330. Mm, I think I've flown one once, that was with Thai, horrible experience, but yeah, that was just Thai back then. A340, never flown one. Seven five seven seven six seven. Never found one. Okay, three hundred. This ATC volume is too loud. I can't even hear anything. You probably can't even hear me. Instruct radio volume. Yeah, let's turn that right down. I don't know how that got up there. Okay. How's this aircraft look? Oh, it looks nice. Also, yeah. Okay. I think mm, this fence is the most annoying thing. I would have to say 50, 40, 40, 30, 30 20, 20, 20, 10, yeah. pull up. I know that was a hard landing. Oh, come on, this is so annoying. I have to put down the brakes and then I can't concentrate on the actual landing bit. That's a bit that annoys me. Okay, look at that. I would say that's a made it, yes, that's, that's technically. Yeah. Oh, wow, wow. Oh my god, that's... Technically I've went over just a tiny bit, but... Wow, okay. Let's take a look at the replay of that. Also, make sure to like and subscribe, as I'll be doing more videos like these and other cool videos, including plane spotting. And also... Why is this not playing? Also, I'll be doing a giveaway shortly, so stay tuned for that. That will be one of the steps to like and subscribe, so... Okay, and one of the steps will to be also jo to join my Discord server, but currently YouTube's not really working, it doesn't put it in the description. That isn't too bad for a short runway landing, I would say. What? what? Oh, okay, spoilers were not on. I thought they'd just come on automatically. Okay, that's why. Let's try this one more time. Okay, that's why. The whole time the spoilers have not been engaging on the ground. I thought there was like an armed setting, but obviously there is not. Did you know you can see the f uh, aircraft forces acting on your aircraft? Yes, I did know that. Okay, we're nearly finished through here. Loading, 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 loading. Okay, the video's probably going long, but yeah, I'm not really going to record it again. Because if I record every single video five times, then yes, that's not going to be too good. Okay, thrust down, speed brake on, gear down, flaps, uh, if I can reach that from here. Flap handle is hiding, we need to be shy, flaps, that perfect. And then let's take a look if there's an armed setting. Um, no arm setting, look at that. This gear looks quite nice though. Okay, I've got no clue where my aircraft is going, but it's uh, pretty much on point. Okay, I need to get a, bit, a little bit lower. Uh, let's go thrust up. Go to about 123. 200. So we'll have to probably land with the spoilers on. Which is really irritating, because if you see real life, they don't do that. Another annoying aspect of X Plane 10. Okay, 50. 40. Slow down. Put those on, put those on, put those on. 20. 20. 10. Okay, brakes on. Okay, still that wasn't too good, but... Okay, 60, 50. Okay, look at that, we've made it now. Okay, so that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, share. I also have a Patreon page now. There are prices that suit all budgets and patrons get, patroners get many perks. Once again, thanks for watching this video of mine and I hope that you enjoy the rest of your day.